19 after right now. Last May, Gary Dotson, who was granted clemency, uh, was granted clemency, and he was made a free man. It happened after Kathleen Crowell Webb, uh, the woman uh, he was convicted of raping, said that uh, her charges against him were lies. Since then, Gary Dotson has failed in his attempt to get a new trial to clear his name, but he is trying to rebuild his life and is engaged to be married to Camille, and now I'm going to botch up this pronunciation. I know Dardanes, right. correct? Thank you. Uh, whom he met, by the way, at his own clemency hearing last spring. Good morning, Camille, and Gary, nice to see you, and congratulations, Steve. You. you just met at the, the hearing. What about potential doubt in your mind, given the public nature of all of this and what the law has decided to do and not to do and so forth? What doubts, if any, in your mind, Camille? I've never had any doubts. Um, after I met Gary, there was never any doubt. Once you get to know him, he's there's there was no way I could ever think anything happened. How surprised are you at the way you met, right? You you approached him, right? <laughs> right. How did that happen? I mean, it's one thing to agree with, you know, what you see in the media about his position. It's another thing to make the effort you apparently did to meet him. What, how did that? Um, well, I, I went up to him, I gave him a flower, and then later on, uh, like a week or two later, we went out for a drink. and. Well, I, I don't know, things just kind of ran around ever since. <laughs> We've just been going out and having a lot of fun, and we just stayed together. What about the unanswered questions for both of you? How have those affected, if in any way, your relationship? The unanswered questions and the continuing questions that people have raised with you, Gary, or have in their minds if they don't raise them with you? Well, in general, I've never really asked uh, these questions, but uh, they've also got a book coming out, uh, uh, that I'm doing now with uh, Jeannie Rosted and uh, David um, Ed Fish. Fish. Did you learn anything new about the whole thing, or is there, uh, are we going to learn anything new from this book? Oh, I'm sure of it. I understand you're collaborating, or you're going to, no, you're sharing in the profits of a book that Kathleen Crow Webb is doing? Is uh, well, she, she plans on turning all money she, she makes from her book uh, over to me. How comfortable are you with that, of receiving money based on this whole experience, given the legal aspect? Well, I've been in contact, con constant contact with her for the past past month, and she she's sincere and she really wants to do this. And uh, you know, I spent six years in the joint, uh, and she, she wants to do this, and she's comfortable doing it. How, Camille, how? How confident are you that you'll be able to live a normal life and get away from the media aspect of all this? I'm hoping so. <laughs> you know, otherwise there's nothing much to go on. It's just hope. Um, we want we want to be left alone like anybody else and live our life. Well, good luck and nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. Thank you. Very good to see you. Thank you very Thank much. Thank you. We'll be back in a moment. Uh, Bo Bridges, next half hour.